All of this of what I'm about to show you is for educational purposes only and for the purpose to raise awareness to those who are not aware and who are ignorant to what is taking place in our world. While your attention may be drawn to the gourd on my chin, let's focus on the message here. First of all, who is tired of CPS taking children from loving homes and families and putting them in abusive situations? Me, I am, are you? Yes, you are. We are all sick and tired of what is going on in this country and I want to also mention something else. We are being suppressed slowly and by people that we are supposed to trust with our children. Do you like podcasts? Well, check it. I got a podcast. Me and a couple of my buddies from Kentucky, we got a podcast. It's called News You Can Use With Us and you should really check us out. We are on StreamYard. We are on YouTube, Facebook. We're trying to get on TikTok. Somehow I'm gonna utilize my platform to air us on the podcast on TikTok. Maybe that's something we could do this week. Let me introduce you. This is my squire. Now, if you don't know what a squire is, <laughs> well, honey, you must not be country. A squire is a partner, a companion, that helps the world know that you have arrived. It lets the world know that we have arrived. My lovely homegirl here on Stop Corruption, Break the Silence, Kentucky, she's with us too. You may have seen a very popular post by her before looked a little something like this TikTok suppressed it because of something laying very close to the dresser there yes let me tell you there's a lot happening in this country if you live in the state of kentucky oh you are not going to want to miss the podcast that we have going on on wednesday nights now i don't know what time because my time zone is not their time zone but i'm sure as they see this video they'll comment below again let's not focus on the gourd shall we and please please if you will go to my bio and tap on that link tree you will see at the very top is a petition. This is the petition. We have got to make changes. We have got to make changes within our country, within our government, in order to get our real freedom back to be parents and to be families and to most of all, be children. It is becoming a time where children cannot freely be children anymore because of fear that they will be locked away, put in foster care. Well, what if foster care doesn't work out? Then what? What do they do? Oh, they become like my son, Joshua, who is now being tossed about from facility to group home until they can no longer make money off of him because that is truly what it's all about. Remember when I told you that your children were walking paychecks? I meant that. You think that was a joke? Remember when you go check out that tree over there that I was telling you about a minute ago? Don't forget to check out the article about incentive bonuses and foster guardianships that lets us know that they get at least $26,000 when a child is placed somewhere for more than 90 days. That's whenever things begin that can roll into an incentive bonus that the department gets. Now, don't come to me and say, oh, we don't get bonuses, because yes, you do. I've got the proof right in my bio, okay? So stop lying, stop believing a lie, and start educating yourself. I mean, 
I'm not anti-CPS. I am anti-deception. I am anti-corruption. And I am anti-cheating to get what I want. These kids don't deserve this. You cannot tell me that my son was better off in facilities than he would have been in a loving home with a loving family. You can't tell me that this child is better off where she is. And remember, there's things laying around that tell us many, 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 many details. You cannot tell me that this parent is better off without her child for the sake of someone in a position of authority. Follow these people. Follow these people. Let us educate you on some of the things that you may or may not know about where you live. News you can use, and it is spelled that way because we don't want to get pushed down in the feed. Let me tell you something. These two squires of mine, they have been working their butts off to get information out to you, and their accounts continue to be suppressed. It must change. And I ask that that change start today. I pray that we are no longer able to be suppressed on this app. I pray that our voices and our content shines brightly like a beacon, like a lighthouse. And I pray that those of you who are looking for people like us,